Welcome to the first tutorial for Voices VR Producer. Voices VR Producer is a 360 VR live streaming tool. So you create a scene and then you can live stream it to YouTube, other RTMP sources, you can save it a file or you can send it out over SDI. In order to have something to uh, get started quickly with, uh, let's just set up a stream to YouTube with an echo rectangular image. So Voices VR Producer uses a scene graph and here you can add entities. So let's add an echo rectangular image. And uh, for this I've chosen to use this uh, beautiful Vista from California, which is Creative Commons license. I'm gonna open the image for that, which is here. And here you can see it. So it's echo rectangular image and it's echo rectangular projection, uh, which is, uh, so this is what we're expecting to see. Uh, Voices VR producer uses an edit view, which is what you see here, and a live view, and it's the content of the live view which is sent out. So we make a transition so that what it is in the edit view right now gets into the live view, and the transitions can be found up here. So I will now make a cut transition, and this now you can see that what we had here appears here. So let's stream this to YouTube. It's very easy, you just select YouTube here, and here you have the options. Now we have to go to the YouTube page, we have to go to the Creator Studio, we have to select Live Streaming. It's important to select Events here and not Stream Now, because Stream Now does not support 360. So we create a new live event, and we give it a name, we make it uh, private, and here it's important that we go into the Advanced Settings and select that this live stream is 360. Now we can create it. Now we get to the ingestion settings. So let's uh, do this at 4K and 60 FPS. Uh, and then we, we need to copy the stream name here because this is what identifies the stream uh, on YouTube so that YouTube knows which stream we're streaming. So we copy this. Then we go into VR producer. Uh, we select the same 4K resolution. We select 60 FPS. We paste the stream name and then we start streaming. And now we are live on YouTube. So let's go back and verify that. So we can go to the live control room here. And now let's see what the stream status is. And the health is good. So now we are live streaming at uh, 4K 60 FPS to uh, YouTube. Thank you for watching this first tutorial.